Hey guys, it's Aislinn and in today's video, we are cutting my hair. I just woke up and I was laying in bed and today's the day. I really wanna cut my hair, I'm so over it. I don't wanna deal with it anymore. It's stringy, it's thin, a lot of it has fallen out. I'm just very over it and I don't want these thin, nasty ends anymore. I just want a very cute, blunt, short hairstyle. I'm very excited, I finally feel ready, so we're gonna do this today. I wanted to hop on here and show you a good before of what it looks like dry. That way you can see where all my breakage spots are. So let me show you what we're working with right now. So basically, if I section my hair right here, pretty much this whole section of hair has fallen out. All my length is gone right there and it's like that all over my head like right around this area all of my hair is super thin and a lot of it has fallen out my ends are just very straggly and thin you can see all of this breakage right here so i want to basically chop my hair like up to here and get rid of everything down here on the ends i have breakage like i said all over my head and it's the exact same length so if I like pick up all of my hair on the top of my head, you'll see all of these short pieces and they fall around this area right here. Let me turn around and show you what the back looks like because the back is the exact same situation. Here's what the back looks like. I have all of this breakage up top and my ends are just so thin and non-existent. Also, my color is fading a bunch. I've been showering like normal with hot water. I've not been trying to preserve it at all. Because my hair is so broken off in certain areas, it's really affecting my color. I noticed this past time I dyed my hair rainbow, it has really changed the color drastically. The colors that are here around my face are not in my lengths because obviously all of that has broken off. So the only color that's really noticeable is blue, green, and yellow. And I don't like that. So we're just gonna cut all of this off. And then within the next week or two, I'm going to freshen up the color and re-dye it. So that way it looks a little bit better and I'll be feeling really good about my hair again. I'm just really excited for like a fresh start, a new journey, a new haircut. I'm excited for my hair to look thick again. And I'm just very over the way it looks and feels right now. I'm gonna go hop in the shower, wash my hair, and come back with wet hair so that way we can start cutting it. I'm so excited. Okay, I'm back. My hair is freshly washed, it's clean, and it's wet. It's perfect to go ahead and cut it. Look, you can see like right now, all of this breakage, <laughs> like pretty much my whole side. So that's pretty much what we're going for. I'm actually gonna do it a little bit shorter than this. Yeah, I'm nervous. I've only cut my hair one time before for YouTube and it was a similar haircut and it didn't turn out that well. So I'm really hoping I don't have to go somewhere and get it fixed because I don't wanna spend the money to go somewhere and get it fixed. And also I feel like I could do it by myself. I hate going somewhere to get my hair done. Like I would much rather just try and do it myself. All right, so let's, let's try and do this. I'm very nervous. I also have not told anybody that I'm doing this. My husband has no idea that I'm cutting my hair right now. All right, so we're gonna take four sections. I'm gonna take a section behind my ear on both sides like this. That seems good, right? If you cut your hair wet, just know it's going to shrink up a little bit once it dries. So I'm going to leave a little bit more length for right now and then I can go in and cut more off later if I want to. I was thinking about tying off my hair into like four different sections, but I kind of think I'm just gonna cut it. How do you guys feel about that? I think we should just cut it. All right, so here's what the front looks like. I think I'm just gonna cut it. I don't feel like tying it off, especially since it's wet. I think I'm just gonna go straight in and cut it. I think I'm just gonna start like right here and just go for it. Oh, that feels good. <laughs> that felt very nice and refreshing. Wow, that was actually quite a bit of hair. It feels mushy. Okay, that is way shorter. <laughs> oh my God. This is, um. A little bit shorter than I was thinking. 
I was thinking maybe we would start down here. <laughs> okay. Well, you know what? We're already in on it. We're going to go for it. Am I right? We're just going to go for it. Okay. Let me try to measure up these two sides. Wow. Y'all, I'm cutting off a lot of fucking hair. I hope I um, like this. I think I'm gonna hate it, but that's okay. It's fine. <laughs> okay. Those look even. Damn, did I do that good on the first try? Hello? Hello? <laughs> okay, let's bring around the back. Let's put the back in two sections. <laughs> this looks hilarious. Okay. This is where it gets a little bit more difficult because it's hard to cut the back of your hair. Okay, I think I'm just gonna grab little pieces at a time. Throw that back. Right? Okay, definitely uneven. Oh my gosh, you guys. What am I doing? What in the hell am I doing? How is this so uneven? I need to go to a freaking hairstylist and have them fix this for me. <laughs> I literally can't handle myself. This is hilarious. I was gonna wait a couple weeks to like re-dye my hair, but um, I'm thinking I should probably re-dye it like today so it looks better because I feel like this cut with faded dingy color might not be the move. And I think I would like it more if it was like bright and like freshly dyed. I'm really like at a loss for words. I don't know what else to do right now. Maybe we should just continue. Well, there's that. Ooh, that hair is so lifeless and dead. Oh, whoa, I've never had my hair this short, like ever. I definitely went too short the first go around, but we're working with it. It's totally fine. It's gonna be all right. I'm just trying to think about how I'm gonna fix this. Like I need to go somewhere and get my hair snipped and fixed. How do people do this so well on YouTube? Like people just cut their hair like it's nothing, like it's no big deal and it looks like perfect. Maybe because they like actually tie it off and like section it out and shit. <laughs> I'm kind of just over it at this point, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just like, let's just cut it all off. All of this just needs to go. I'm tired of like having this little, this little straggly section right here. We're just gonna chop her off real quick, all right? Dee, 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 dee. Boop, boop, goodbye. Okay. It does look way thicker. Okay, so now we have the basic shape. This side's longer, this side's shorter. The back, girl, I don't even wanna see it. I don't wanna know. <laughs> I already know what it's gonna look like. It's gonna be like this. It's gonna be straight and then woo, down to a V. I'll turn around and show you guys. <laughs> It'll be comical. Does it look as bad as I thought? Here's me looking down. Here's me looking straight. Actually, a it's not that bad. Like it's not that bad. It's hard to cut my own hair because I have like wavy hair. So as I'm cutting it, it's like the wave is coming through. So it's hard for me to make sure everything's even. I have to like keep combing everything out. I'm like so scared I'm gonna cut my fingers too. <laughs> I can't handle this. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go try and fix the back of my head off camera because all the lighting and the mirror behind me, I like, cannot see what I'm doing for the life of me. Okay, I should probably not be just doing this right now. <laughs> all right, let me go try and fix the back of this. Update, I'm going to a salon to get it fixed because I fucked up and I can't fix it myself. 
I'll see you guys in a little bit. <laughs> Hi, I'm back from my haircut. So she fixed up the back for me. Let me turn around and show you what we're working with. Much better. Now I'm gonna blow dry my hair and put on some makeup and come back to show you the final result. I feel so much better now that she fixed the back for me. And I actually think it's very cute. And I'm excited to see what it looks like, you know, like dry and styled. So I'll come back once I have my makeup done and my hair styled and blow dried. Hey guys, I'm back. $27 and a confidence boost from you guys. And here I am, <laughs> feeling good, loving my haircut. You guys really boosted my confidence. I went live and hung out with you guys while I did a little bit of makeup and you guys just made me feel so good about my haircut and you guys are the best and I feel so good about it and I love it. I think it's so cute. And also I didn't even straighten it. This is just it blow dried and I really like the way it looks. It's so thick. I mean, do you see this? I got some thick ass hair now and I'm so excited and it feels so good and refreshing and it's just like a new start. I'm just very excited about it and I really like the way it looks and I hope you guys like the way it looks. Let me um, take these down. Boop. Here's what it looks like just straight. There's a little bit of a bump right here. Let me show you the back again. I didn't straighten it This is just blow dried, but it is all even now and very blunt and nice I really like the way it looks. I think it's cute Hope you guys like it too because I really like it and I really like wearing it like half up like I had. It, this is also gonna look really cute with like beachy waves. I honestly, when I first started cutting my hair, I didn't intend for it to be this short, but like I'm really glad this is how it wound up and this is what it looks like because I really like the way that this looks. I'm just gonna straighten it a little bit to make it like not as poofy. Although just blow drying it gives me so much volume and it's so crazy that my hair is now thick again. I was so used to just having like straggly ends and now it's like very thick and nice and it feels so good to have like healthy, blunt, thick, nice hair. Like, oh my gosh, I really feel like I took my hair for granted. And so I'm gonna be more careful with my hair in the future. And I also love these just two little baby pieces. And you guys agreed with me when we went live, but I think that this is gonna look so cool when I have like bright, fresh rainbow hair. I told you guys my husband doesn't know that I did this. So I'm gonna try and get his reaction when he gets home from work. So that way I can like include it in the video and you guys can see what he thinks because I think he's gonna love it. I've never had my hair this short before. I have had it a little bit longer. Like I had it like down to here. I think that's the shortest I've ever had. And he told me that was his favorite hairstyle when it was like up to here. So I think he's probably really gonna like it. Not that I really care, you know, it's my hair, my choice, but I'm excited to see what he like thinks of it, you know? Okay, my husband is getting ready to walk in the door from work. He has not seen my hair yet, so I thought I would get a reaction for you guys because you guys said you wanted one on my live earlier. So I'm about to show you his reaction. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> That's all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> as long as you're happy, I don't care. Yeah, I'm but do you like it? it? Yeah. Mm. Cute. <laughs> do you actually like it though? Yeah. Okay. There you go. <laughs> I haven't been to a stylist to get my hair cut in the longest time. And I was very nervous because I went to a new salon in my town that just opened up. So I was like very um, nervous about getting someone who did not know what they were doing because it was a walk-in. So I was just like, um, hi, <laughs> I uh, cut my hair at home. <laughs> I was like, I need help. And she told me I didn't do that bad of a job. Just the back is hard to do. 
And I was like, exactly. Like, she understood. She knows. It feels so good. I just feel like there's like a weight off my chest. And I just feel really good and positive about it. So here is the finished haircut. Feels great. I'm just like very happy. I've been in such like a good mental health state lately. And I just feel like everything in my life is improving and like everything is just falling into place and this haircut just feels like a part of that it just feels right and i keep like catching myself in the mirror and i'm like okay like she's cute like i like it and these are thick now like look at that look at that thickness bro seriously she got thick hair again at first i was like i'm looking like lord farquad i've made a mistake a bad decision and now i'm like wear this haircut's flawless i made the best decision ever i'm so glad i woke up today and said today is the day i'm very excited with all that being said that is all for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to check out my instagram the link to that is in the description down below i post way more of my everyday life on there give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it i love you guys so much and until next time stay weird goodbye i'm happy